This episode of the Totally Rad Show is brought to you by Carbonite. Coming up, we plop down in front of the TV and watch the creepy new FX show, American Horror Story. Everybody, so we're here in uh, in TV. Uh, I'm still shaking. Jeff and I have just uh, seen a screener of the pilot episode of American Horror Story, which is going to be out. Uh, I think today, right? Isn't yeah, this as this episode Wednesday? airs, it'll be out tonight. So tonight, October fifth, Wednesday, October fifth, on FX. Uh, it's uh, it's created by uh, uh, Brad Falchuk, uh, who's a writer on Glee. And Ryan Murphy, who co-created Glee, yeah. co-created Nipto. There's a lot of similarities to Glee. It, it seems like they decided, let's do the thing that is as far away from yeah. Glee as yeah. we can possibly We get. know high school students. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Anti-Glee. <laughs> so uh, American Horror Story um, follows this family uh, in present-day Los Angeles who moves into a creepy-ass house. And then creepy-ass stuff happens. Uh, Pretty much. Dilma Marooney, right? Is that Dylan his name? McDermott. Dylan McDermott, not Dilma Marooney. I always get those two mixed up. <laughs> Dylan McDermott. Dylan McDermott. The practice. The practice. Right. Uh, um, uh, Jessica Lang. Yes. Creepy Jessica Lang. Tammy Taylor, of uh, course. Tammy Taylor, yes. Uh, a bunch of a bunch of other people. Connie, Connie, Brighton. Connie what is it? Connie, Connie Brighton. She's Brighton. Tammy yeah, Taylor. yeah, yeah. Yes. That's where I remember her yeah. from. Hysterical. Uh, as Ruth well as Fisher. others, as well as others, also known as uh, but American history, uh, I always say American history, yes. <laughs> American horror story uh, follows this couple and their daughter who move into this house in Los Angeles that by all intents and purposes is haunted. Seemingly. Well, I think you had it better when you said crazy stuff happens. Well, crazy stuff happens. So Jeff, yes. we just saw it. We just saw it. What did you think of the pilot episode? <laughs> um, it's spectacular. It's a spectacular pilot episode. Um, okay, first of all, <laughs> it's, it's on FX, which is my favorite network. Uh, you, you know, Justified, yeah. the best series of all time, The Shield. No. Uh, always Sunny. Always Sunny. It, it, the, it's my favorite channel. And the balls of doing this show, it, it, this is, um, if you like um, uh, Weird. Twin Peaks. Oh, Twin Peaks, yes. For example, mm -hmm. this is going to be that kind of thing where 60% of the people who see this are going to hate it, but but 40% are going to love it. Yeah. And I consider myself in the 40%. Yeah, yeah. It, it is it, it is disconcerting. It gets under your skin. It is it, it it's truly scary, which is yeah. very difficult to do nowadays. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and not in a boo kind of way. I don't think they're really are any boo moments. No, not really it's, any jump scares, but a it's lot uncomfortable. of uncomfortable. Yeah. The way it's shot, the way it's edited, it always makes you feel, you know, there's Dutch angles everywhere, there's strange jump cuts where yeah. a few frames it looks like have been removed. Uh, there's so many moments where you just never really feel comfortable. And yet, you have a show about something. It, it's not just trying to scare you. It, it's really dealing with human beings in human situations on a very emotional, true level. You have this couple who is basically trying to get past a- Infidelity, past a, infidelity, yeah. Exactly, and it, but not in a sensational way. It mm. feels very real. Yeah. Uh, and you have great actors in great scenes acting with each other. There's a, you know, there's all this crazy weird stuff that happens and there's disturbing, you're like, you know, kids Imagery. with Down syndrome and like weird, like yeah. ginger twins. And you know, there's lots of like odd yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then you get in the scene in the middle that is this really human interaction between yeah. a couple in the midst of this crazy house. And you know, crazy house is not a unique premise for horror. No, crazy we house see it is all very, the time, right? come on. And so when, when we it was, all have friends that live in crazy houses, right? You know, get out. Yeah. You know, that's uh, okay. that's not something we that's rare for horror. Yeah. I, I, I was almost worried that oh, it's another one of those, just crazy house, right? Yeah, yeah. But there's some weird stuff going on, and I, I, for my money, Jessica Lange is worth the price of admission alone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's yeah. 
awesome. And also, um, oh, what's her name? Francis McDermott. McDermott. There's too many McDermott. Ruth Fisher for the, the Six Feet Under fans. There like you me. go. Yeah, you go. Uh, well, I totally agree. I think, uh, I, I mean, it's, it's b ballsy is a great way to put it because I don't know if, I don't think this TV show gets made for any other network. Um, maybe HBO. Maybe HBO. Yeah. Maybe AMC, maybe. Yeah. But it really, I mean, it's like one of those shows. And, and it starts off not as scary. Now, we did see a pilot, a, a sort of pre-air pilot, so I have a feeling they're going to do some more sound design stuff, which mm. I think will even amp up the uncomfortability. Because at the beginning, I was sort of like, Okay, I get it. You know, it's. I thought that first scary. scene was pretty disconcerting. It was disconcerting, but it wasn't. I didn't. It didn't mm. eh, hook me. My God! By the end of this, I wanted to just crawl under my bed and go to sleep. I mean, I was like, I don't even <laughs> yeah. know what is happening. Yeah. And there's some disturbing things that yeah. happen, where when you realize what's actually happening, it's like this is some messed up stuff. Like yeah. this is not. This is not for you know. This is serious stuff. And some unique ideas, right? Like oh, stuff yeah. I've never seen before. In, in you know. Yeah, and it's one of those things where the the, the thing that's going to be interesting is can they sustain that kind of. But not only can they sustain that kind of energy, can I survive yeah. watching this every week? I think that's a great point. I, half, I'm a little bit like, through, I don't, I gotta, it's like, geez. I think you make a great point. I, halfway through, I was like, I don't know if I can like emotionally handle yeah, this. I, this, every is, week. this is the kind of show that'll show up on my TiVo or my DVR and I'll be yeah. like, I don't know if I'm up for uh, watching that. I had a that. really good day today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know or I had a tough day and I don't yeah. think I can handle Yeah, yeah. But it's good. Because it's, it brings you there. Because I was really afraid. I mean, when, you know, we, you see all the sort of trailers and stuff and the promos, and you can't really get it from a trailer specifically. Because I think what it really is is all about the tone, this yeah. uncomfortable tone that is set. Uh, and I mean, I'm definitely gonna watch the next episode. Oh, me too. And from I'm what we've heard, some spoilery stuff that we're not gonna talk about. But that if that actually plays out, the yeah. thing that Dan said that you didn't want to remember. Yeah. But I think I just made you remember. Yeah. If that actually plays out, could be one of the most amazing things for a series ever. Uh, this right. This, I haven't you know been exci saying, right? excited from a pilot like this in a while. It, yeah. It is. It, it really feels like something completely well, especially different. Especially this year. I mean, this oh, is yeah. by far the most excited I am about any of the new TV shows. It, it it really is that like Twin Peaks thing of like of like what am I even watching right now? Yeah, yeah. And yet really grounded sense. in and yeah, human. Yeah, and it makes sense. Yeah. yeah. And it's setting up its own rules, and that's there are and little one line things that are you know don't yeah. maybe kill you again. I, I, was, yeah. I was in. Yeah. So, uh, American Horror Story on FX Wednesday nights. A must watch, but, you know, have but, someone you, there you with gonna you. Are going to walk me home? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. like, it, it, it's, I'm disturbed. I'm truly disturbed. Yeah. But, I mean, that's what you're signing up for, a, mo a show that's called American Horror Story. It's right in the title. Yeah. You should know what you're yeah. getting and into. And look at any of the posters, and you'll know what you're going to get. Man. Yeah, there's some moments that I was like, what are they, they're doing that? Yeah. yeah. It's good stuff. Believe that. Boo, yeah. All right, everybody, be sure to stick around for the stay in rad history. But first, we want to thank our sponsor, Carbonite. Computer disasters eventually happen to everyone. Wait, everyone? Like everyone. Everyone! Everyone! Yeah. <laughs> what movie? Your what computer movie? What movie? crashes. What? The professional. No. Leon. No. Yeah, actually, that is what it is from. Are you sure it's not yes. the fifth element? Yeah, it's, it's the same actor. Not the fifth element. It's the same actor for professional slash Leon. Computer disasters eventually happen to everyone, whether it happens in movies that you may know or not. Uh, your computer crashes, it gets infected with a virus, you drop it, theft, fire, ETC, which is the worst of them all, uh, the et cetera. Uh, <laughs> could be ET anything. Your stuff. Uh, ET ah. sees your stuff. But if you get Carbonite online backup before your disaster, then you never need to worry because your files will be backed up automatically and safely off site and it's super easy to get them back plus you get anytime anywhere access to your backup files from any computer huh. on your smartphone ipad with a free carbonite app that's actually amazing that you could be out and about and like oh let me just check my carbonite backup yeah there's that file boo yeah, yeah. uh with carbonite ultimate uh, uh unlimited backup for your pc and mac is just 59 dollars a year that's less than wow. five dollars a month for peace of but, mind when you use the coupon code TRS when you check out, you get a 15-day free trial and two months free if you decide to buy. That's great. That's crazy. All the details are at Carbonite.com. And remember to use the offer code TRS when you purchase. Don't forget. Two months free. Amazing. Back up your schnuff.
your schnuff. And if you want to send us schnuff to put on our background of our schnow, you shouldn't schnew that. Yep. Fans of TotallyRadShow.com is where you would send it. You can get our logo if you go to Flickr.com <laughs> slash TotallyRad. Ah, so, small seizure? <laughs> small C, big jerk. Tomorrow on the show, we check out the new movie, Real Steel. Today is October 5th, and on this day in Rad history in 1969, the first episode of Monty Python's Flying Circus aired on the BBC. <gasps> Amazing. Yeah. This is like... I changed comedy forever, I would say. Damn skippy. And uh, did we, I don't think you were a fan. No, I like their movie. I, well, you know what? I would watch the show sometimes. I always uh, was excited to see the animations. Mm -hmm. The Terry Gilliam younger. stuff, yeah. 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 But, but you didn't love? You didn't, I didn't love. I think I, 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 so, I Dude, my yeah. folks would watch it on PBS at night, and I would sneak out of my bed and sit and watch through the door over their shoulders, watch the screen. And I was like, I think those are guys dressed as women, but this is funny. Yeah. <laughs> Tennis, anyone? Lionel. Thank you for sending that in, Alexandre Bebe.